Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to some Hero Arena shenanigans, man. So, this time around, we have two buffing units, which is Melee, which is going to be absolutely broken on this, and King, which I don't have because I'm very unlucky and I have yet to pull him. Uh, I'm not sure if I give one up on it yet, but we'll see. I'm saving gems for some multis, maybe. Shop's not too much different from what it normally is. Basically the same thing, nothing changed. As how the teams are right now, I don't think they're going to be too difficult at all. I'm pretty sure like the same teams we've been using for like the past few times, it remains the same. So goddesses, humans is always like very strong in this and unknowns, of course. And then again, you will have like the undead team and then you'll have suicide teams to make up where you can. Uh, but since Melly is currently buffed, I am going to try this out honest to god because melee king and merlin are all in my like main pvp team so you'll see them through awaken and stuff that's why i'm i decided i'm gonna give this a try but one major problem is my gear sets you'll see here it's not the best it really isn't my gear is so mixed up on this team it's kind of crazy like how out of place it is but i'm hoping this would work when i did this run Not too sure in the card says I just chose this one just to test it out. We wanted to go for more crit resistance for Melee and Merlin and just full crit defense for both King and Yan. For the most part, I think Merlin is the one that's going to be focused because there's a lot of red in this and they're going to go definitely head on into her. So crit resistance for her, definitely. First play, I'm just trying my best to keep Merlin alive because she is going to be the one fully targeted if you don't have a taunt up. So just keeping her HP high, it was one of my main focus. The thing about it, Melly just souped up in this. You don't really need to worry about him like living or doing major DPS because he's there for it. Every, the, the only problem, the only thing you need to really focus is having higher HP so you can really advance um, stages because you don't want to have like some units lower hp you want to try to get like full hp at max every single time so getting maybe a dian's ult off it's gonna be your final option like look at this damage it's insane how good melee is like, he wipes most teams easily. So, I'm just gonna play for, like, a Dian ult to get her. Because I know if it's just Harmia, I can just force someone else's ult. Make sure he gets, like, targeted. So, I can, like, use my Dian's ult. For the most part, he should just go into, like, the, the first unit, which is Melee. Even if he tries to remove Gage. So, I should have my Dian's ult here, no matter what. Even though my HP is pretty much full here, I just had to, you know? Because it's like, you want to go for Dian's ult as your ender every single time to come up with full HP, best case scenario. That's what I think. The second team, it's not really too much of a threat. The only problem is... As I said, yeah, my gear is pretty bad. So, Merlin comes very close to dying because of it. That's my terrible gear right there. If she had died there, I might have reset the run. And just tried it again and had maybe better RNG. But luckily, we don't have to. And yeah, you gotta attack with her because you want that HP. So, no Dian taunt. And we already know Melly's like a menace. So, just go for the easy one shot and just heal up. Because here is only the, the real major DPS on this team anyway. And Infect's not a problem anymore because of Melly. Easy cleanse. So all about just getting Dian's ult once again and trying to end with full HP.
even if I don't get like a merge for the end, I would what I would do, I would probably just chip down any other unit and maybe leave Nanashi alive last. Or Freya alive last. And just chip them down until I can like fully heal. I had an option like this, so I just pushed her out. Just go for like an immediate end. Don't waste too much time. Luckily, the lifesteal as well on this team is insane. So you don't really need to have 6 6 ults or anything. This team, the only real threat here, I think, is Heinz. The faster you get rid of him, your team will just survive. The DPS in this team is not really a problem. If anything, your DPS is more of a problem because you kill them faster than anything. Any unit here, you can kill super easy. But the problem is they're chipping away your HP. You want your HP back. So what I'm trying to do is just like kill down units. I'm, I was going to try to keep either Rimuru or Roxy alive and just get my Dian's ult and like pop off. Same as usual. Best case scenario would be Rimuru. This guy just merged level 3. I'm like, oh, it's it might be over. I survived luckily. And I just... I realized I don't really have any single targets to kill him with. And if I if I burn like too many AOEs, I wipe this team easily, and it's it's gonna be a wipe for me because my HP would not be able to like survive the next team. So I need to have better HP before I leave. So I offer this plate. I'm hoping I don't wipe. If I if I had killed Rimmer there, I would have restarted. I would have used different cards. Hands down, because it you need you need to heal up before going through. Through unfortunate circumstances, we just don't get the end cards. The next team is like not too, it's not heavy on DPS your turn one. If anything, they're gonna go full on into try and kill your Merlin because it's a red team. So the end's HP is not too much of a factor, but you still wanna have like best hp possible right so i'm trying to stick around i thought maybe i i risk it and tank maybe i risk it and tank like the 6-6 six, six remove but i decided nah you know what i'm gonna just go through just heal my king up maximum get some hp back for merlin and just go through don't even risk it because it could all be over with just one ultimate from him and i'm not sure how well i tank it so i don't want to risk i just go through So yeah, rag team. Their turn one isn't too strong against this team, luckily. So we tank this pretty well. No crits, which is amazing. That's why I want like the crit resist on her. Because Merlin is like super focused. She has insane life steals, so it's fine. As long as you live, the AoE just goes off. And she's pretty much back to full with one AoE. same situation as before you want to have an ult with the end before you leave because you want like max hp if, you got, if i had gotten a merge it had been perfect but no merges for like the end so i'm just gonna push my ult for the end and go for the best i was thinking about killing brunhild first but decided not to i'll just go into the end Get rid of her so I can get like a better heal. I'll kill her next and we'll wipe it all and like a melee AoE or something.
Right here, I'm not sure if the king level 2 would just kill. But I don't want to risk the end living. So I just use the... I just burn the melee. I'm like, it's, yeah, let's burn it. Just get rid of her. Then burn the king. Weaken them slightly. Get that bit of, like, extra DPS from the end. And we wipe. We go through a full HP. I, th I think that's the best play I could have had there. Maybe the AoE of king would have killed. But I didn't want to risk it. I'm kind of happy this team is at the end of the towers because Roxy having her relic right now, it's kind of a problem, right? She's hitting a little bit too hard and Deanne does not have good gear, so she's just gone. She's just dead. She, like, not having per- if Maybe if I had perfect crit defense gear on, like, a better set instead of, like, because I'm missing crit defense. She, I think she would have lived. I really think she would have lived. This is why I say <laughs> melee with sins is just kind of absurd because honest to god I literally thought I'm just gonna heal get my shield up debuff them so we get a cleanse in for the next turn and I did not expect this melee straight up wipes the team level one this team for me is pretty much built because this is the team I have like like max cosmetic because this is my pvp team so yeah, that's how one done with something a little different. That's not the regular teams. So yeah, have a good one. Thank you for watching. Peace.